currently on my way to a call out for a girl with an injured ankle we suspect it's possibly broken she's on the lower slopes of kinder uh, for those that know it's somewhere near peter nook wood which is just above the reservoir one of our teams has already set off and uh, i think they've just beaten us to the location so they'll have set up a cas site uh, probably be able to spot it by the casualty will be inside the big orange cas tent so that'll be set up now we've got mick one of our paramedics who's with them uh, he's he'll be looking at it to make a diagnosis as soon as he can then we'll decide how we get out of here um, it's not going to be an enormous stretch of carry back to the Land Rovers because uh, we are only going around the edge of the reservoir but that's being said I think we've only got about eight people available um, this, this afternoon so we'll see what happens if it's urgent we may ask for a helicopter if not it's just manpower with the eight of us who are here and we'll see how quickly we can get it back to the Land Rover. first team that went out generally goes quite light and um, their job is to find the casualty as quickly as possible, work out what's wrong and work out what we need to do to get them out of there. Uh, I was in the second party today and that is the one generally that if there's nobody else they get diverted to go and pick up any heavy gear. So that'll be us in full. Uh, we're carrying the stretcher in two halves at the moment, rucksacks on the top which is heavy enough as it is, but when you add it on the top of a, of a half a stretcher, it's bloody heavy. So we're not far away now. Hopefully we'll get to the cat site soon. Um, in a further development, we've also heard that there is um, an S92 Coast Guard helicopter on the way. So unless they get diverted, that will be the primary route out. She does appear to have a pretty seriously injured ankle, probably broken. Um, fortunately for us, the uh, S92, the Coast Guard helicopter, is inbound now. Just coming in behind me. Um, they're going to either land down or winch from here. We'll find out in a minute. has picked up the 
casualty now. Um, they're going to take her to Barnsley in the end. I think they said Sheffield General had a long waiting queue, so it was quicker for them to get her to Barnsley. We're just packing up the gear now. Um, we're going to walk the uh, rest of the party back to our Land Rovers and then ship them back down to our base where we can send them on from there. I um, guess I'll have a bit of a drive to catch up with her when she eventually lands in Barnsley. So there's been a slight change of plan. The helicopter was originally planning to fly the girl to Barnsley, um, but they, en route they decided that it would actually be quicker for them to land in Hayfield and get a road ambulance to pick the girl up and take her to Stepping Hill. They could then go on to another job. Um, as it is, we're just currently waiting for the ambulance to turn up. Once it does, we're going to have to help them just get our stretcher, the girl on our stretcher, out of the helicopter and into the road ambulance and then we'll finally be done. <laughs> 